welcome back to my channel. So we have just arrived in Cebu. We are staying in Mualwal, Mualwal. Not sure how you pronounce it. I probably butcher that so bad. But yeah, we arrived in Cebu yesterday. Actually, we flew from Manila to Cebu, and then we got a taxi to the bus station, South Terminal bus station, and then we got a like a three-hour bus to. Well, well, so yeah, we arrived here yesterday. The bus was 209 pesos each, which is really cheap, obviously, for such a long journey. But it did just leave us off in like the middle of the road, so like we didn't have a clue where we were going. Luckily, the, luckily there was some tricycles about. They did like completely overcharge us, like they charged us um, 250 pesos just to get from there to here, and we were like trying to bargain with them, but then we we're like, whatever. Um, I think you should usually pay like 150 to 200 maybe. Um, but then we did have our big suitcases too, so we couldn't really argue. So yeah, that's how much we paid for that. Um, we are going to get a bike. Doogie is sorting that now, so we'll let you know how much we paid. Our hotel quoted us 400 pesos per day, but Doogie's going to see if he can get it, or if it's worth that, or else he'll get it from somewhere else. But yeah, we're staying in a place called Balton, Balton Home Point, I think it's called. I'll put it up on the screen. Um, it's actually, like, so far so good. We booked the family room, which was... 35 pound a night it comes with two double beds and it's really really like spacious um i think it'd be perfect if you had like a couple of friends coming here because then it would be like a tenner a night and you could all stay in this one massive room like that's probably like the price of a hostel anyway so yeah um we're here for four nights complete disaster like oh my god i can't believe this happened so the full reason we were coming here was to do the canyon here at kawasan 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 waterfalls i am so bad at pronouncing things um that was like the whole reason we were coming here we had booked a couple of days so we could chill today, go there tomorrow, and then chill and then go back up. Landed here, so the boy was like, yeah, the weather's been kind of bad, so the canyon air was cancelled this morning. We were like, oh, no way, like, that's the one thing we want to do. And he was like, yeah, but not the Kawasan waterfalls, like, they're closed. And we were like, what? And he was like, yeah, they're closed. They had, like, health and safety come around, and they had to shut it down because it wasn't safe. So I don't know if it was, like, the water wasn't safe or, like, the jumps and stuff wasn't safe, but something. They weren't doing something right. So they're closed for a couple of months. They're literally not open they are closed for months and i'm like oh my god you have to be joking me like that is the reason we came here and he's like yeah you can do other ones so like they're a bit expensive and they're further away but i'm kind of got the fear because i'm like are they always safe i don't want to go to these other ones and then something happened do you know what i mean so i'm like i already know if i'm going to do it now because that's kind of put the fear in me but i cannot believe that they are cancelled because it says nothing about it online they obviously don't want it to get out um but yeah cancelled so that's not great and then they also like if the weather's bad like and you get kind of near and book for the morning like they'll just cancel it so i'm not really sure what our plans are for the next four days well three days i think because that was like the main thing we wanted to do so just an fya if you are coming here in the next couple of months you can't do that kind of near and see those like deadly waterfalls because it's closed so yeah we got our bike we just bought it when do you pay yeah. We got it for 400 and look at her helmets. They are ghetto. Oh, look at her. She's stunning a wee clickety click. And this is my helmet. <laughs> look at the shape of this. I look like a mushroom. Guys, we're up getting breakfast. We're at a place called Shaka. We got these smoothie bowls. They were two smoothie bowls, and our coffee was like ten pounds. So I don't know if that's dear enough. Is it? Do with that what you will. But yeah, we're going to eat this and then just explore the bike. and something hit me on the head. <laughs> I don't know if it's bird shit or what the fuck it is. It's in my hair. Ooh, I'm sick. Clean your head first before you clean. What the fuck is that? <laughs> no, seriously. There's a pure shitload on that. Literally Holy in my helmet and all. You're looking to swap helmets next. Yeah. Right, we have came to White Beach. You tell them. How much was it? Ryan, just say like. No, it was a 10, 10 pesos per person and then 20 for the bike. Yeah. Look at this water, it is literally as clear as anything. Oh, this is unreal. I 
came to the gym. I know we're not wise, but it's called JP's Fitness Gym and it was 200 pesos each. So we're just going to do a wee quick session here. Oh my god, look at the sweat. That is sweat from my chin. We are at a wee bakery here getting some lunch. Doogie had a bear earlier because he thought he lost his wallet. Had a stream back to the gym and all. Where was it? Under the bike. Check it twice. Under the bike. So yeah, Doogie's going to call it four. So we have him here because the wife and her looks up like great. So we're going to sit here and have some lunch. Or not lunch. Okay, we ended up being in that place way longer than expected. We had like a longer life, but it was only in stand up. Um, but we've come down to the beach here to see sunset. There is a lot of clouds, but it's still lovely. It's so like chill here and calm, and the water's so calm, like it's so quiet. The drive down wasn't. Oh, the down drive was down was hectic. There was, I said I was having a sensory overload. There was just, <laughs> there was like smoke coming from somewhere, and there was be people beeping, and there was dogs running across the road, and I was like, oh my god, what is going on here? But yeah, we're just going to chill here for a while, and then we're going to find somewhere for dinner. Hey guys, we're just out for dinner. We came to we Italian, got some margaritas. Not looking the best, but we'll try it. But yeah, I'm really, really tired. I don't know what's wrong with me, so I'm gonna eat this and then I'm gonna have an early night. So we'll see you tomorrow. Take a taste test first. Oh, okay, sorry. Oh, go on then. Oh, it's warm. Like, I like a more doughy thing. What was the word you kept saying about the. Uh, Sip beer. Sip beer. I mean, sorry. It's not life changing. Good morning, guys. We are out for breakfast here now. Um, we were meant to go up, get up, and go for a run this morning, but we actually slept into like after nine, which is so unlike us. Like, I don't know the last time we slept in that late, and it would just be too warm, like going for a run at eight o'clock. So, we didn't go for one. But we're at a place called Smooth now to get some breakfast. It doesn't have the biggest breakfast selection, like, especially for me as like a vegetarian. But we're going to get something here anyway, and then we are off to a new beach. I got these wee breakfast taco things. I'm not really sure, it's not what I expected them to look like. <laughs> you got a whole bird bath and chips for his breakfast. Yeah, what? It's like 30 minutes away from that we cafe we were eating in, but the views were unreal. Um, this beach is so nice. So it was 45. What? Lambog. Oh, sorry, Lambog, not Lambog. Lambog. So yeah, it was 45 pesos in each, and then that was just entrance, and then we had to pay 50 for parking. But then we were trying to like scramble in our bag looking for change, and he just accepted 30. So we're thinking we probably didn't need to pay that. But anyway, it's grand. But it's actually really like nice here and like proper like holiday vibes. I'm loving it. And it's honestly so warm today. Well, how is it? Honestly, this water's like warm. I'm just gonna be Okay, so straight off the bat, that is not the right bread. It wasn't toasted, it was just put in the microwave too. Too warm. Let me see it up close. 
probably turn you back. Alright, that's not the same. You can have a small knife. That is not a tie dance, never mind. Nope. Oh, I'm going to have to go and get a bit of a Thanks, point five. I What's the tail I'm on? I'm at what is the tail I'm on? Nine point seven. Yeah. And if this was crunchy, I think that'd it. be nice. Like a toast day, but that's like an Italian. I'd say it's like fucking okay, Italian white bread. I just recorded a whole segment there and then didn't actually record any of it. Now I can't remember what he said. But what I basically said was. Look at the shape me because my hair is a mess. Our whole video was going to be drone footage and we're going to see sunset and we don't know what we're doing for dinner. So there's it rounded up. Guys, what do we think of my new necklace? I am officially an island girl. Bought it off this wee man. Oh my god, he was so young. Like honestly, about five. And he charged me 100 pesos. And like in Bali, they would charge you 100k for this, which is like a fiver. Um, well, they'd started that. Obviously, bargain down. I couldn't. I couldn't with them. So I just took it and I'm obsessed. Why have I not had one of these before? Batch my clip, but we've got some beers. We are at this bar here, but there's no seats, so we're just sitting on the thing. I'm gonna drink these, and he's gonna get the drone up. He's like, hurry up! I need to get the drone up. good this looks. These cheese chips gravy are unbelievable and Doogie asked for no lettuce, tomato, onion but she gave him no bath as well so he's in a wee calorie deficit over there. Yeah. That honestly, I don't know if I was just starving. That was a 12 out of 10. That was absolutely divine. So if you're here. Like the plate. What's that 12 out of 10? No, if you're here you need to come here. The veg burger was delicious. The chips were real. The beef burger, burger was deadly. Beef burger is a actually the day after but I filmed so much today that I think I want to make today a separate vlog. So this has been our first few days in Walwa. We have had the best time ever. The beaches have been unreal. Um, but yeah we're hiking. We hiked to the highest peak in Cebu today. So you'll see that in my next video. It was unreal. Like the drone footage we got was just oh my god. That's why I'm like I don't want to cut anything down. Like I want to have all the footage so I don't want this video to be too long. So yeah, we're doing two. So we'll see you in my next video for the second half of this trip. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.